I'm uh, Major Billy C. Hall. Okay, I'm from the state of Texas, near Amarillo. When I was there at my radio station, no, where the guns were, where my little single caliber gun was, I seen this airplane out try, trying to come in, and I could see the twinkle, twinkle, twinkle off the wingtip, so I knew he was firing, and it looked like he was firing at me. And so I shoved my gun over to his position, because when a plane is making a pass, it's going fast and getting out of there. So uh, I went like this, and it's gone. And so I will go ahead and do my job. And later on, when I get the bomb, bombs out of the bomb bay closed, I sat down in my position, and I know that I've got a wing tank. I mean, I've got a, a window here and a window here. And I look, and it's fluid all over that left window. There isn't any on the right, so I know it's not rain. So I call my pilot and tell him about it. He says, well, let me check. So he starts checking. He says, uh-oh. He says, we've gotten hit in the left gas tank, and we're losing losing all the fluid out of it. Called the pilot, and he, and he came back. He looked at the instruments and said, uh-oh. He says, we've gotten hit. We've been hit in the left wing tank, and we're losing all the fuel out of it. We don't have enough fuel to get home because... You use part of each tank uh, to keep balance on the airplane. Now we've got fuel, but we've got it all on the right-hand side, and there's not enough fuel to get us back to to uh, Munda, where we were flying from. The pilot knows that the, the CB, or uh, Navy Construction Battalion people, had made some... Uh, secret runways on from some of the little little bitty islands, and then covered them back over, so that we a pilot could come in and make an emergency landing on one of these and get fuel if necessary. So my pilot knew where one of those were, and it was close enough for us to get to. So we came in and landed. Took a, had they had placed 55 gallon drums of gasoline there. So we pumped up gasoline in the barrel in the can, poured those into the right hand uh, wing tank, and flew back in. The next morning, when they got a chance to uh, look through this, they discovered a 90 millimeter round, which is uh, about like that, and about like that. But it is designed. It's got smoke, incendiary. I'm a uh, tracer, all kinds of stuff to be able to explode in case it hits anything. So that should have ex exploded our wing tank off, but it didn't. It was a dud. So we got, uh, they pulled that out and gave that, pot, that uh, dud round to my pilot, and he carried that around in his pocket for the rest of the time as uh, a souvenir uh, and his lucky, go lucky piece to, to get us through. Mm -hmm.